What is up? For those of you who don't know me, my name is Max Boyer. I am a 16 year old um, high school distance runner. I'm actually about to turn 17. But anyway, tomorrow I'm going to be um, showing you what it's like to be a high school cross country runner. So basically a day in the life. So I will see you guys in the morning time. Also, don't be dumb like me and go to bed late. It is like 10.55. Definitely do not do that. Be smart, guy, and get your sleep because it's very important. But I mean, hey, I'm trying to show you what a real day in the life actually looks like. But now I'm actually gonna go to bed before 11 o'clock. Okay, that was a hot one. What is up, guys? I just woke up. It's like... Well, I woke up around 7 o'clock, but I'm still in bed right now. Um, but yeah, let's go. So normally I eat a banana or some oatmeal about an hour before, sometimes 30 minutes to an hour before I run. So it's like 7.47 right now, so that means I'll probably start running at 8. Okay guys, so I'm warmed up now. Before I go, I have to say goodbye to my mom. Just kidding, my mom already left and I am not Zach Levet. But I have to say goodbye to my cat, Clementine. Guys, this is Clementine. Somebody's about to jump off me. <laughs> Gotta grab the Infinity Reacts. So I think today I'm just doing like three miles, something very easy, because tomorrow I have a steady state run so basically a tempo for like 20 to 30 minutes so I just want to take it easy today okay so normally I do some glute activation before the run but I forgot to bring um, the elastic strap so I'm not doing that it's kind of kind of hot outside it's probably a little bit over 70 degrees but yeah today I am running in the infinity runs and sorry it's so bright I should have brought sunglasses Today I am running in the infinity runs and probably yeah, three miles, but yeah, let's get into the run. Just nice and easy today, guys. Okay, that was a hot one. About 3.12 miles, I think. It'll be on my Strava. Um, 22 minutes, 57 seconds, so not bad. A little nice, short 5K. Normally, I'd go up around like, you know, six to eight, or six to six to 10 miles for um, like the daily average, but I'm just taking it easy today, because again, tomorrow I have that tempo workout. But yeah, I'm gonna head home and show you guys um, what I eat after I run and what I do after I run to recover fastly. Back from the run, you know I gotta pull out the chocolate milk. This is just some um, almond milk, but yeah, chocolate milk. I think I'm gonna make a protein shake. Sometimes I drink a smoothie. Of course, I do love my oatmeal, but I think today I'm just gonna do a little um, nice and easy protein shake because I don't wanna waste time making a smoothie. I'm actually mixing um, chocolate milk with vanilla um, protein shake, so I wonder if that's gonna be. I literally just tried to put the protein shake um, bottle's cap onto it, just slip through it. Okay, honestly not that bad. Chocolate and vanilla is the thing now. 
you know, normally I like to roll out bef after my run while I'm drinking the protein shake. I don't know if you guys do that. I know one of you um, asked what do I do for like my recovery and my what I do after my runs for the Q&A, but I will go more into depth with that in next Thursday's video. Seems like today I got lucky and the muscles aren't too tight. Of course, I just ran, but it seems pretty all right so far. A little tight, a little tight here, but kind of on the IT band. Yeah, let's continue rolling out normally after practice. I really recommend running earlier in the morning because I ran at like 8.30 and even though I ran three miles, I was drenched in sweat. Okay guys, so I'm done rolling out. Um, normally after I'm done rolling out, I like to just rest, lay on the couch, read a little bit and do whatever I need to do to get my body uh, back to normal. Of course, normally I'd be doing schoolwork, but right now since the summer, I'm normally, normally just chilling outside and uh, just enjoying enjoying the weather. A lot of the times I like to do um, little bike rides to get that active recovery in and just get the blood flowing through my legs. Hey guys, and a lot of the times I also do do core and um, other strength workouts, but today's just an easy day as I said before. But if you guys want to see um, more core videos and stuff like that, then subscribe because I might make um, a core routine video. Set, set.